Ariana, I saw you tweet out that you were like putting the songs for your album in order. Yeah. What's going on? Um, what's going on is we're releasing two new singles before the album actually comes out because I'm still shooting Victorious, so I don't have enough time to go out and actually like promote an album because when you release an album, you have to go out and like promote and go radio yeah. tour and stuff like that. So I don't have enough time to do that right now, so I'm going to be releasing it probably in around September okay. because of like that, then I'll have time to do it. But in the meantime, because I need to keep my fans like happy and I want to give them stuff to listen to and stuff, I'm releasing two new singles, um, one of which is called Do You Love Me featuring Sky Blue from LMFAO and the Dap Kings, which is one of my favorite bands. Yeah, I'm so excited. It's That's really huge. cool. Yeah, it's really cool. And the coolest thing about it is Sky Blue's grandfather is Barry Gordy, who okay. is the founder yeah. of Motown. Wow. And so he actually, I believe, like wrote the song Do You Love Me and we sample it in the in the song. So it's really cool. Oh my and I'm really excited. It's very different for me. It's it's like it's like Motown, but then it like turns very dancey very quickly, yeah. so it's cool. Well, I know that we got we had the lovely opportunity of hearing a bunch of your songs, and I feel like that's such a great quality about your music is that you do get that throwback vibe, but it's very modern at thank the same you. time. Is that what you're going for? With yeah, music? I was trying to capture that, yeah. so thank you. I'm glad it, <laughs> I'm really glad it translated. Um, so yeah, thank you. Hopefully soon we'll be seeing you play here at Wango Tango. Would you like to do that someday? Absolutely, I would. Hope Maybe next year, hopefully. Oh, Fingers okay. crossed. So, okay, I saw you tweet out a photo from the Victoria set. Were you, what were you covered in? What, what, what happened? Flower. I was covered in flower because I got flower bombed, which is like they throw flour in your face. Uh -huh. And it was so scary. Like right before, I thought that I was going to like die. I thought I, I was so nervous, and I thought I wasn't going to be able to like keep acting. Oh I thought I was going to crack up, but I made it, thank God, in one, in one take. One take, so oh, that was like the scariest thing of my life. I thought I was gonna die, but it was okay, and it was <laughs> and it was fun. And I had flour on my lashes, like a hammock, like laying in my just lashes. Just like settled in, right just, there. Just, just literally, it was so funny. <laughs> So, okay, you always look incredible. You have the most amazing style. Our viewers love your looks. Um, what's like a go-to summer must-have for you? Basically, my entire summer wardrobe this summer is just like summery dresses like this one. Love it. And um, these high-waisted old like 50s denim shorts. That's so cute, yeah. And uh, little like crop top things. Yes. Just because it's going to be really hot and all this stuff and uh, little bows and of course, like I'm such a loser, but whatever. Um, yeah, and just sort of like old school inspired girly like dresses and stuff like that. Okay, last question. Can you sing us a line of like your favorite summer anthem right now, like the song that you're just obsessed with? Um, I had to think of one. I don't know what they are. I don't know. I mean, I'm obsessed with like boyfriend, Justin Bieber. I can't get out of my mind. Was your boyfriend? I never <laughs> let you go. Well, can you rap it with me? Swaggy. I like the buzz light. Oh my god, when he says swaggy. Yeah, he's like, swaggy. I die. I die. It's so cute. Swaggy. Okay, what's the other line like? Um, buzz light your fly across the sky. Uh, something about falsetto in three, two. Say hello to falsetto in three, two, swag. <laughs>